Okay, so skip counting can help us learn our times tables. So, um, rather than writing out all the numbers um, in the times table, what we can do is we can leap. So we figure out how do we get from here to here, and here to here, and here to here. How do we do that? Well, each time we're adding three. So zero add three is three. 3 add 3 is 6, 6 add 3 is 9, 9 add 3 is 12, 12 add 3 is 15, 15 add 3 is 18, um, 18 add 3 is 21, 21 add 3 is 24, 24 add 3 is 27, 27 add 3 is 30, 30 add 3 is 33, and then 33 add 3 is 36, okay? And the 3 times table, let's have a look at it. When we skip count from 0, so we have 3 times 0 is 0, 3 times 1 is 3, so that's 3 times 1. 3 times 2 is 6. So that's 6. 3 times 3 is 9. So there's 9. 3 times 4 is 12. So that's 12. 3 times 5 is 15. 3 times 6 is 18. 3 times 7 is 21. 3 times 8 is 24. 3 times 9 is 27. 3 times 10 is 30. 3 times 11 is 33, and 3 times 12 is 36, okay? So, um, skip counting can help us. So you can also do it like this, you can draw. So, if you have, let's say for example, the question is what is 3 times 3? You can just um, draw 3 sets of 3. So, 1, 2, 3, that's 1 set. 1, 2, 3. As a second set, one, two, three. It's another set. Then you just count the lines in there. So that's your first set. It's your second and your third. Three times three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three times three is nine. Let's try um, another question. So the question might be, what's three times five? So I'm going to do five circles. Um, with the three times table, so let me circle that so I know how many circles to do. So one, two, three, number one, one, two, three, number two, one, two, three, number three, number three, number four, one, two, three, number five. So now I can add them all up. Um, last time we said so that's that was nine, so from here is nine. So 9, so we just add 3 now. So we know all of this is 9. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So 3 times 5 equals 15. When we leap count, so we go 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 3 times 5 is 15. Let's try another question. If it says 3 times 0, so it's 0 circles. And um, there's not going to be anything in here because we're timesing it by zero. So there's nothing. There's no threes at all. We don't have any three. So it's going to be zero. All right, let's do one more. Um, let's do three times uh, eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's two. One, two, three. Three, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, five, six, one, two, three, seven. Lastly, one, two, three, eight. Okay, so we know three times five is 15, so let's cross off the first five. So, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. So, fifteen, let me add these fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Three eights equals twenty-four. Okay, I hope that was helpful for you guys. Yeah, just have a great day. Bye.